<laughs> God, you are, we are bastards. We are just bastard people. Well, we're back. I think we have a keep. <laughs> Yeah, this is a keeper. Yeah. Riddle Smith, couple artifacts. Yeah, do it weapons. already. You've already wasted a lot of time. Okay. No more. No, we don't want a mulligan. We're on the draw. No surprise. Nope. Not only do we lose rounds, <sighs> we matches, always lose. And everything. We always we, lose to draw. Yeah, we always lose with the dice. And we did some scouting. We found out that this guy has an incredible <laughs> blue-white metalcraft deck. Yeah. Uh, heavy on the chrome steed. Uh, uh, strangely enough, no infect at all that we saw. All right. So he'll probably win. <laughs> yeah. Oh, great. The perilous mirror. Which that is a funny looking animal. Awesome. So get out the riddle smith because it's our only two drop. Yep. I I'd trade it <clears throat> actually. And he'll do oh, damage to us though if he sacks it. Oh, we're not even gonna get the chance. No, be dead before that. Interesting enough, he's got. That's weird. That can't be good for us. No. Why would he put that in there? Um, probably just the removal. I don't know what he would be proliferating. Uh, we have some choices here. The replica would shut him down. Yeah. Not that he's you know really ratcheting out to anything. Uh, Blister Grub, we know he's not playing... I would say the replica has to play. Yeah. And Any of those left? We can get to the snap sail glider. Or two. Put it on the desk. That's right. You heard him. <laughs> Put the money on the table. That's right. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's leave the money on the nightstand. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's just how we feel after we have to I'm not sure we even really earned any of that money. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did he just make his perilous mirror fly? Oh, yeah. I hope so. Yes, he did. Basically, he just drew a card. Under the skies of flight. It's still doing damage. Right. <clears throat> The Perilous Mirror has never been happier. Uh, here I would say maybe Snap Sail, and that way next turn we can play right, another artifact. and attack with the flyer. And attack with the flyer. You got it. And I would also say probably attack with the replica, because he's not going to block it with the mirror. We get one damage in. Sure. If he attacks, you get one damage in. I don't know. Snap Sail's not great <laughs> when you're playing against blue white because he's going to have better flyers than we do yep the razorback griffin i hate that thing it's a griffin it's like three two something like that comes into play brings an artifact back from the graveyard is that does, it? does it have metal craft of some kind no but no. it brings back an artifact that's yeah. what you need. pretty bad does, and does you gain like... life for the the, in the converted mana cost of the artifact returning. It looks like the best Wait, card ever. Hold on a second. Why would you have to convert the mana cost of an artifact? Well, no, no. It's, it's called... It's, the technical term is converted. It's just but not. it's... Not, <laughs> no. But there's nothing to convert. You're absolutely right. There's nothing to convert. So maybe... It's just the, the mana cost of the artifact. You're right. You've completely broken down the entire system of the game. What I'm saying this is... This makes it shut down now. Screw Magic the Gathering... Because, you know, it's different, and I'm a little too warm as a result of drinking. <laughs> you, you can, I'm told you once again, you cannot take off your shirt. I do not care. I do not care. Uh, what do we play here? Well, we could cool. goblin and attack. He black... Block with the mirror and then kill, and kill our arson. So then he still has uh, a three, three, a three, three, and his mirror. Out. How about the necropede? We could put out the necropede. Necropede might be the play because whatever um, it would give him. Um, it would give him flying first off. Right. But, but what's most likely going to happen is he will block the perilous mirror with the necropede, or he'll block the necropede with the perilous mirror. Uh, do two damage to you, 
Or maybe, well, no, he'll do two damage to the glider and kill it. But you'll be able to necropede either his mirror away or weaken his flyer. Either way. Right. It, it's pretty much a wash. And then the Corsicar. And, uh. Or whatever. <laughs> so when you bring the Corsicar out, if the necropede is dead, you could then bring it back to your hand, though. Yeah. That'd be neat. I like that. Okay. Kind of incestuous Corsicar necropede kind of thing. We block with the replica. Yeah. We, we don't even nope. offer the trade unless he forces it. Yeah. Because that way he would have to, he couldn't kill the glider also. Now he may kill the glider, choose to do that instead of the necropede, but now mm -hmm. we're, we still have a necropede. That worked better than I thought it would. Yeah, because we tap with our necropede. Woo! Go necropede. I hate that guy. What's that one? He just gains two life. It's a flyer. It's a 2 2 flyer. He's got a lot of flyers. Hey, that's that card you don't like. Yep. Yep. Okay. Hmm. Um, we could infiltration lens. We could <clears throat> goblin. Maybe goblin. And attack with and two. Attack with two. Sure. Put some pressure on him. Yeah. And he will not block. He will take that. Yeah, probably will. Mm -hmm. If he does block, I could see him blocking the goblin, trading it somehow. But yeah, he took it. No, I, he figures that's the only poison damage we're going to get this entire game. So, infect damage does not do normal damage as well as infect damage. No, you have infect, no. you only do infect. Yes. Right. Got it. Yes. Okay. But that also warps any type of damage that you do. Like say with the ar you know, with the arbalest on a normal creature, it would do life damage. But if you put it on an infect creature, it does infect damage. Gotcha. Yes. So nifty. See the things you don't know. It's yeah. Fillable. And it's a, you know people still are making those mistakes. You know they're still thinking that uh, they can you know block certain things or whatever. And not have to worry about the effect after effects. Mm, we're in. Yeah. We're in a world of hurt. We are. He's yeah, got to do something. There's a that. lot going through the sky. <clears throat> um. Okay. I think we have to put out the arbalist so mm. we can maybe equip it next turn and do something with it. We could put out the infiltration. I got the live wire lash. Yeah, that's not good. Okay, so we can either keep <clears throat> Nurek Replica mana up to bounce something, or we can Infiltration Lens on one of these guys and attack and hopefully draw two cards. Wouldn't Bouncing something be more annoying for him than not? Oh, yes, except we have to sacrifice this guy in the process. Oh, that's yeah. fine. And, and both we... of his critters that we would get rid of uh, do stuff when they come back into play. Right. So I think we want to put it on the uh, yeah goblin. Yep. Yeah, because we now actually kind of want him to kill the necropede. Other side of this is if we attack and he doesn't block, he can just attack with everything and win. Mm. So we can't even attack. I mean, we've lost. Yeah, this game is done. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even think we could top deck anything. No. Nope. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, and that makes it even worse. Double strike and life link on everything. Well, that's a bomb. That's bomb city. <laughs> We're done. Bomb city finally made its appearance. Yeah. Okay. Legitimately. There was a round. That's my, catch, that's my I, new catchphrase. I think phrase. That you should switch out all of your blue and do a green deck and no black instead. Just completely fuck with it. <laughs> that, like, I, uh, huh? <laughs> I think it's a terrible idea, but 
at the same time, we're certainly not winning the way we're doing it. No. Um, I say we stop this because it's yep. actually under 15 minutes. Sure. You destroyed us quickly, and we'll be back for round two, game two. 